um, and today I'm going to show you how to use place value counters for column subtraction. I'm going to start by showing you column subtraction without exchanging and then I'm going to show you with exchanging. First, I'm going to show you how to work out 647 minus 235. When we do column subtraction, we always subtract the ones first. I've made the number 647 using 600 counters, 4 tens counters and 7 ones counters. And underneath, I have put the number I am subtracting, which is 235. I'm going to start by subtracting the five ones from the seven ones. I need to remove five counters and bring the rest down into the answer box. Then I'm going to subtract the three tens from the four tens and bring the remaining ten down to the answer box. Finally, I'm going to subtract the 200s from the 600s and bring the remaining 400s down to the answer box. So 647 minus 235 equals 400 and 12. We can show this by drawing out the counters. And then the numbers written without the counters. This time I'm going to show you what happens when there are more ones and tens in the second number than there are in the first number. I'm going to use column method to work out 735 minus 367. Then. We need to remember to subtract the ones first when we do column subtraction. I have made the number 735 using 700 counters, 3 tens counters and 5 ones counters. And underneath I have put the number I am subtracting which is 300, 6 tens and 7 ones. First I need to work out 5 minus 7. This time there is a problem. I can't take seven counters away from five counters. I need to exchange one of my tens counters for ten ones counters and put them in the ones column. I now have 15 ones, so I can subtract the 7 ones and bring the remaining 8 ones into the answer box. I then need to subtract the tens. We have 2 tens and we need to take away 6 tens. Because we can't take six tens away, we need to exchange one of the hundreds for ten tens and place them in the tens column. We now have twelve tens, so we can subtract six tens and put the remaining six tens in the answer box. Finally, we need to subtract 300 from the 600, so we have 300 in the answer box. So, 735 minus 367 equals 368. I hope you have found that useful. If you did, please like my video and subscribe to my channel. I'll be uploading a video with something new every week. See you soon. Bye!